Continue the story from where you left off. ambience for discussion. We're developing techniques. It'd be nice if you could join us. Who, me? Your climbing was quite innovative. It's the truth. Sure. First, here's a technique I thought of. Allow me to explain the bridge. If you must cross a gap, move a block over it to create a bridge. That way, you can reach the other side of the gap. What do you think? Did you know that one already? Oh, what about this then? Allow me to explain the flying bridge. Using principles of the bridge, gaps two blocks wide are no problem. Push the same block twice to push it to the other side. Then, add another block next to it to complete the bridge. Wow, I knew it! You're not just a regular guy. That's really cool, buddy. I think that'll help me beat the next area. Hey, hello. Do you want to review the techniques? I gotta go. Good luck to you guys. Hey. I feel like I've seen that pianist before. I can't remember where. Whatever. I'll let you in on a technique I figured out. Yeah, let's do it. Allow me to explain the spider. If there is a block in your way, try dangling off the edge and moving around it. It's a useful way to go around a block to find another place to stand. By moving around, you can skip having to move blocks. your guard down. I wonder if my girl's the witch. Oh, you mean the one from the rumors? She got all worked up all of a sudden for no reason the other day. She was just stabbing her dinner with her fork, man. I thought she was gonna reach over and gut me. Maybe you just like those kind of women. Men who want to control women tend to have a desire to be controlled by women. It's the truth. Wanna talk about techniques? Yeah, let's do it. Allow me to explain, if there is a block in your way, it's a, by moving them. You mustn't let your guard down. Look around. I passed out here last... Does that mean... Have you seen them? Yeah, those two sheep who attack you while you're climbing. They're trying to follow you or what? N no, they're just crazy. I don't know what's going on, but I've done it too. Seriously? Tonight's product is... <sighs> Damn it. I know there's somebody in there, but I can't see. Surprise! 
I didn't expect to have a visitor. This must be the first time such a thing has happened here. What the hell is going on? You know something about Ren, don't you? Let's just say the tide has shifted. Thanks to you, something unexpected is taking place. Regardless, I'll continue to ask you questions. This is the third question. Would you feel guilty if you cheated? memories with you when you return to the real world. So I'm gonna forget this place when I wake up? If you were to try anything in reality, it'd be troublesome for my game. That's the rule. No exceptions. Each type of block follows its own set of rules. Pay close attention to the behavior of each one if you wish to survive. Oh, damn it! Those traps again! Commencing area two. Are you ready? Vincent! Rin! Where are you? Up here! The ground below is falling! Please be careful! Are you serious? Give me a break! From here on out, Rin will use a special power to support you. When Rin starts to play the piano, the rate at which blocks fall will slow down. Take advantage of the situation and climb quickly toward the goal. Stop! <laughs>
down. Undo. Edge. Edge. If you can't find a way to pull, Edge. you may wish to undo and try a new strategy. Just calm down. Vincent, no! I can bear it. Edge. Die here. Undo. If you can't find a way forward, you may wish to undo and try a new strategy. I got it. Fudge. I can't die here. We want to help. I can bear it. It may be best to try and undo your move. to try and undo your moves. Go back undo. and undo some of your right. moves. Go back and undo some of the edge. Undo. Edge. I got it. Edge. Like this. Edge. Right. Edge. I made it! Here I go! Impressive. 
impressive. I admit you've surprised me. calms me down. Listen, we're kind of in the middle of something. Shut up! You're not the only one whose life is at stake here. That piano saved me earlier. Don't worry. I won't stop playing it. Sorry. I guess we'll have to talk later. Yeah, this isn't really the time, huh? But I'm so happy. I didn't think I'd ever be able to repay you. I hope I can help you somehow. <laughs> It feels good to be able to help everyone. I'm going to practice some more. Looks like you're sticking around this time. Yeah, you're right. Maybe because I'm still playing? When I put all my emotions into playing the piano, I finally remembered something. I remembered my family praising me. Really? I hope that means you'll get the rest of your memory back. With her here, I just might survive. Yeah! I think I can make it! Sometimes, you just love doing something even if you're not any good at it. Like me with drawing. Comes out crappy. But hey, it's fun. I bet that's how it is with that girl and her piano. There's a charm to it, you know? Listening to that girl play piano does make it a bit more bearable. It's like what they say, third times... Ah, third times... The charm? Who cares what cliche you're using? When you're a writer, you gotta have a way with words. Mm-hmm. Two's company, but... Three strikes and you're out? <laughs> Did you actually say that? Do you know this way to climb? I get the feeling something big's coming up. Want to trade techniques? Sure. Allow me to start with the technique I developed. Allow me to explain the swing out. When you pull a block, drop and hang, then move to the other side. Now you can push the block. It's useful in tight spaces. Remember this one. Not a bad trick, you think? I have more. Allow me to explain the toppler. If a stack of blocks is full of holes, Pushing the lower blocks is an option. By causing blocks to fall, you may find a path upwards. That sounds useful. Oh, I just thought of something like that. Maybe this will help. Allow me to explain wall suspension. By using edges, you can connect with blocks forming walls. Blocks make edge connections on all sides, not just left and right. Suspend them from the walls and make new footing. I see. I didn't think of that. Buddy, you got moves. If I was a chick, I'd be all over you. Do you want to review the techniques? I gotta go. I get it now. It's you. Those sheep, the one with the pompadour and the one with the glasses, they're talking about how to climb. Yeah, but why don't you join them? Hmm. <laughs> you don't sound very enthusiastic. It's a pain. Living, dying, it's not cool. Hopefully there's no annoying guys like my boss. Ah, I want to climb, but these other sheep get in my way. 
They mess up the blocks that I pull out. I'm going to turn them all into sheep stew someday. I want to climb, but these other sheep, they mess up. I'm going. She's the one person that looks human. Maybe she's the only one who wasn't dropped into this nightmare. What do you mean? I don't know, man. <laughs> Nothing makes sense here. This is the woman's wrath, after all. Or so I've heard. Hey. <laughs> Good of you to come this far. <laughs> Jingle. <laughs> You'll never make it to the top. <laughs> You're gonna die. Everyone's gonna die. Everyone! <laughs> hey, get a grip. You freak out, you're never gonna make it out of here. Everyone's gonna die. Everyone! <laughs> what it? Have you heard the rumor about true freedom? They say that true freedom awaits you at the top. What is true freedom? Does that mean that even I can be free too? Free from the life I live? You're only gonna find out if you reach the top. Can you stand? Don't be nice to me. I may push you off one of these days. <laughs> I hear there was a great sheep who escaped this place a hundred years ago. Does that mean I might be able to get out too? Not might, you will. Right, I will get out. Those sheep there are talking about climbing techniques. I think I'll join them. I know that if I keep going up, that terrible thing's gonna appear. Oh, I don't want to go any higher. What do you mean? It's chasing me from below. It's gonna kill me. Calm down. That attitude's gonna get you killed. Well, aren't you cool-headed? You're cold, man. I've got to respect that. I'm so tired of this shit. I just want to go home. Feeling down, buddy? Why don't you let loose and sing your heart out? Hey, why do you know that song? I heard this song a long time ago. I don't remember the name of it. Do you? <laughs> Can't you sing any better? Completely off pitch. I couldn't even tell what song you were singing. Am I really that bad? No one's ever told me that before. <laughs> so you know a lot about music? No, I'm just a cook. Try singing it again. I know one thing, you're not cut out for singing. Hey! Hey! Think they'd mind if I set up a helipad here? Just in case I need a lift. What are you talking about? That's why you're such a fat ass. <gasps> I'm gonna turn your pudgy ass into mud and stew. Hey, that's harsh, man. Ah! Ha <laughs> I see. I see. I had no idea that's how people saw me. Y you can keep insulting me if you'd like. Ah, that, that's creepy, man. I rather admire his honesty. It reminds me of something that happened long ago. Maybe I've... I've been feeling weird lately. Before I know it, I'm here, covered in blood. I get beat up pretty bad, too. I'm all bloody from scratches and bites. It's not like that. It's not my blood. Hey, hey. Please, get away from me. Run! I may even kill you! Shit! I get it now. It's you. <laughs> Can't see. He really should show his face. Hey. I know. Sit down. <sighs> that piano seems to have an interesting power. But will it always be there for you? What do you mean by that? 
It's your destiny, so do your best. This is the fourth question for a new possibility. Would you want your partner to disclose all their secrets? If you want to learn the truth, there are sheep that have persevered in the past. Really? All the way up on the eighth floor is a cathedral. It's said that those who reach that holy pinnacle will have the path of freedom open unto them. How you proceed from there will be up to you. Listen, I can hear the voice of the one trying to take your life tonight. Again? This is the final area for tonight. Use the terrain to your advantage and avoid attacks. Do not die. All right, I got it. All right, I got it. <laughs> when you use an energy drink, you can jump two blocks up. This allows you to move forward when you find yourself unable to climb normally. I 
get it now. Opening the door is crossing the finish line. Your chamber was not enough to restrain you. Huh, you survived another night. Why don't we take another peek into the past? Tonight's theme is the fleeting memories of youth. Come on, don't leave so soon. I'm just filling in for someone while they're gone. Filling in? Damn, I'm gonna make you my own personal cheerleader. <laughs> don't you have a girlfriend? I heard a college student asked her out yesterday. Don't doubt that. I huh? have to go change. Sorry. <laughs> hey guys! I brought lunch again today! All right! Yes! <laughs> She's totally enemy, man. No. Ah, come on. I can dream, can he? You adored her so much back then. Shame how people change. On the other hand, maybe you can change again now. Where will you go from here? This is getting exciting. Catherine? Huh? Catherine? Uh, what is she doing here? I thought I came home alone. Oh, shit. Uh, sorry. D did, did I say something? Catherine. I did? Uh, <laughs> well, uh... It's okay. <laughs> but it's a bit embarrassing. It is? You haven't called me by my name before, have you? Y your name? <laughs> <laughs> what is it, Vincent? <laughs> uh, nothing. Are you fucking kidding me? Hey, are you angry with me? Sorry for coming by out of the blue. Wait, so she just crashed here? Well... I'm more surprised than angry. I just... I thought that you'd want to see me, Vincent. I... <laughs> just Whoa, kidding. hey, hey. <laughs> I couldn't keep myself away from you. <laughs> <sighs> Last night was amazing. It was the first time I've ever done... something like that. What? What? <laughs> Whoa, 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 wait. What did I do? You're gonna make me say it? <laughs> You're so whoa, 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 wait. Okay, time out. Time out. <laughs> You've got ten seconds. Okay, look. Why me? Hmm? <laughs> because I like you. What about you, Vincent? What do you think about me? I, uh... I think you really... Cute? <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> what else? What else? Am I just cute? How do I put this? I'm kind of jealous of you. You seem to live however you want. <laughs> what do you mean? That's normal, isn't it? Vincent, you can live however you want, too. Just so long as you never think 
of cheating on me. <laughs> cheating? <laughs> uh, listen, Catherine. There's something I gotta tell you. Come on. Hey. You think you look good in those? <laughs> yes. <sighs> Quit joking around and listen. This is really important. Hey, sorry. This month, I'm running really late. Huh? I think I'm pregnant. <laughs> Say something. Ah, sorry, uh... So, what are you thinking? So why am I sweating? I mean, I, I have to take responsibility, right? Uh, uh, Come on, say something. Uh, uh, of course, I'm, I'm happy, but... But? This is great. So you're happy. That's good to hear. <laughs> to be honest, I was a little worried. It's so hard to tell what you're thinking sometimes. Oh, don't worry about me. I mean, yeah, it's surprising, but it's not like you're sure of anything yet, right? Well, yeah. Duh. Huh? Go ahead, answer it. Huh? Okay. Hello? Oh, hello. It's me. Ah, <sighs> uh, hello. Thank you for calling. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> hey, I'm in the area. You think we can meet up? Yeah, that's going to be a little difficult. Uh... My number. I gotta hang up or she'll suspect something. Hey, what's that? Hello? You're, you're breaking up. Oh. What was that? Huh? huh? Uh, just a call from work. Said something about a bug, but it got cut off. You know, the reception isn't very good in the office, but it didn't sound urgent, so... Not that. Your phone. Did you get another one? Huh? Oh, this. Yeah, the, the new model came out last week, so... It uh... hasn't been that long since you got your old one. You could have still used it. Didn't you buy a new computer a little while ago, too? You always throw your money away. I... You're going to have to watch yourself from now on. You know what I mean, right? Right. Sorry. Well, it's okay since you've been working hard. After all, I might have to take maternity leave. Yeah, you might, huh? Oh, but I plan to go back to work after having the baby. We'll just have to split up the housework, okay? You can't throw your clothes everywhere anymore. Oh, okay. Also... So you need to make sure you're saving up. And all your late night drinking isn't cheap, you know. So I'll be handling all our bank accounts. I'm gonna go to the bathroom. Vincent, you've been acting weird today. 
No, 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 I'm, I'm fine. I'm fine, really. No, I don't mind being in the smoking section. Uh, hey, is this the smoking section? Huh? Well, yeah. All oh, right. You've got to quit smoking, too. It's not good for the child. Bathroom, gotta go right now. I'll ask my parents when they'll be available. Uh, that was a fucking close one. Hmm? Rin, you in there? You left your door open. <sighs> hmm? Okay, be careful down there. I must have been so tired. I just. Oh, oh yeah. Last night was really something, huh? Uh, last night? You heard it. Okay, uh, I can explain this. It's, uh, it's not what you think. I'm not that kind of guy. I mean, I, I don't even know what happened. You don't. Remember? Well, you know, I've <laughs> been kind of forgetful lately. And, uh, <clears throat> anyway, can we talk about this room? Is something wrong with it? Not wrong. I just mean, what is all this? Like, like that thing. What is, what is that thing? Oh, that? At nighttime, all those lights turn on. It's really pretty. Oh, and that one wiggles when you sink to it. It makes me feel better when I'm down. Well, I mean, I guess that's what the piano is for, right? Sometimes I don't even have the energy for that. These things make me happy just by looking. They're my treasures. You don't say. Well, come to think of it, I used to collect those ninja sheep erasers I got in my cereal. Oh, they might not have looked like much, but I sure did love the damn things. Parents didn't, though. One day they just threw them all in the trash. That's... that's so sad. Only you should get to say what's important to you. I know. I'll give you one of mine. The tip lights up on that one. No, it's fine. But thanks for the offer, though. Are you sure? I want to share my happiness with you. <laughs> You're an odd one, Rin. And yet, it's kind of a breath of fresh air. I've never met anyone quite like you before. So, what kind of people have you known? Well, you know, people telling me to be a man, to grow up. Just a lot of people trying to push their values onto me, you know? I think they're the odd ones. No one can tell you how to live your life, Vincent. Yeah. Oh, right. Uh, here, you'll need a way to stay in touch with Erica, right? Well, there's my old cell phone. You know how to use it? Here, let me show you. Uh, okay, you see this? You press this button here, and then you... All right, you got it all set up. Why don't you, uh, why don't you try sending me a text? Oh, look, there it is. Hmm. Ka 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 Catherine? I'm not sure about the spelling, but, um, that's the name I remember. Wait, when she told me her name, did I only hear the last part? <laughs> oh, I see. So you're another one. <laughs> okay. Is something wrong? No, no. But uh, Rin is easier to say, so can I keep calling you that? <laughs> of course.
at the cafe? <laughs> That's a close call. <laughs> I can't believe she didn't catch you. Dude, is she really pregnant? If she is, your life is fucked with a capital F. It's not fucked yet. I, I mean, nothing's set in stone. So then, what'd you tell her? <laughs> Who's the father? <laughs> I told her I was happy to hear about it. It doesn't look like you're happy at all. This is all getting too much for me, you know? So you're finally tying the knot. Congrats, Papa. Get ready to kiss your wife's ass for the rest of your natural life. No going out late, no liquor, no smoking, no gambling. No relaxing on weekends because you've got to take care of the kids. Really? Dang, that sounds really tiring. Hey, you guys. Quit filling his head with doom and gloom. Erica! Come on, cheer up. Raising a nice, happy family is supposed to be a good thing, right? <laughs> a happy family. Never had one of those before. I can't see it. Yeah, well, you're not the only one. That's irrelevant. It's just because of the way you two grew up. So, Vincent. What's this weird dream you said you had? We'll listen to you tonight. Weird dream? Why are you asking now? I, mean, I really can't remember it anyway. You don't? I was being chased by something. Uh, I don't know, it was scary. <sighs> Sounds common to me. Hey, excuse me. Yeah, and you feel like you didn't get any sleep at all that night, right? Excuse me. Oh, what are you doing here? Did you people know the reason you're taught as a child to count sheep so you'll fall asleep yeah, is... Yeah, yeah, sheep rhymes with sleep or something. Ah, sorry. Hey, boss, another rum and cola, please? Hey, don't be so rough on the guy. One day we'll all be old farts like him. Not all of us. Anyway, you're having these weird dreams because you're cheating. Yeah, I get that, but... Besides, Catherine might be pregnant, right? <sighs> Don't need to remind me of that. It is in a man's basest instincts to cheat. Here you go. Enjoy. Yeah, set it down and walk away. It's about what happens now. Well, have fun while you still can. Those two used to date each other. Feather and Beetlejuice? What? No way! Well, same-sex couples are pretty common these days. That's not what I mean! When two chicks pair up, that's two less fish in the sea for me! Aw, uh. oh, were you seriously thinking of dating them? Just saying. <sighs> What do you think about same-sex couples? Did you really need to call her over for that? Um, is it a big deal? I guess I never thought about it that much. Hmm. As long as you love each other, that's all that matters, isn't it? So they don't even need to be human? Yeah. <sighs> this girl's on a whole nother level. I don't know. I think it's sweet, isn't it, Toby? Uh, I told you, I like girls. You too, right, Vincent? Huh? I mean, yeah. Well, you are dating one. Or two. Shut up. Oh, what am I gonna do with you guys? I guess it's checkmate for you, pal. 
people are free to have whatever kind of relationship they want, but uh, you've been with Catherine so long that it's probably time. Congrats on having a kid. Let's do something to celebrate. It's not for sure yet. She said no, she wouldn't tell you unless she was really sure. You're gonna do the right thing, right? Hold on, Johnny. What are you upset over? Heck, I want to get married soon. You want to meet my parents and ask about how they got married? Now go back home and drink some chocolate milk, kid. Come on, why you gotta go there? Wow. Milk goes with everything. You know, I, I take it back, Toby, my boy. I'm a man, come on. You got a mail. Timing, huh? No, planning out your life ahead of time's a waste of effort. None of us have the future we thought we would when we were kids. But all we can do is move along. Uh, Vincent's stealing your line, Reverend Johnny. Hey, I'm just a stray sheep in the field of life, too, you know. Uh, now that's Vincent. Cheating twice? <laughs> He's really gone uh, astray. I never thought you'd be one to cheat in the first place. I can't believe it myself either. Still, you're a better man than me. Johnny? Better or just more appealing to be around? Because he's less of an asshole than you. What? I am not. Ah, so, uh, you're a bigger asshole? Uh, my phone. tell you that. Huh? What do you mean you can't tell me? Uh, well... Oh, shoot, it's overflowing! Ow! Um, <laughs> I'll see you later! Later? Wait! Is she okay? I guess love knows no boundaries these days, huh? People these days... always getting swept up in the heat of the moment. Of course, my heart belongs to Erica and Erica alone. No one asked. So I guess they're taking applications from the general public for these space tours? Oh, 50,000. That's way too much. With my paycheck, I can't even afford a down payment. And boy, do I have a deal for you. I'd rather put all of my savings into lottery tickets than invest in one of your crazy schemes. I think Rin could hit it big if she just sucked a little less. <laughs> I gotta admit, her style's kind of growing on me. I'm gonna see if the bathroom's open. You know, Chief doesn't talk about his girlfriend, does he? He did say that he didn't plan to marry her, huh? He's so perfect at his job, I just kinda assumed that he was the same way in private. In school, he never dated girls that he wasn't fully committed to. All the girls said he was just too defensive. Ask him about it, Toby. Aw, <laughs> oh, come on, that's not fair.
excited to buy our dishes from there. We just heat it up, and it's good to go. Boss used to do the cooking, but he's got a bad hip these days. Well, I'll keep that in mind next time I eat here. Have you heard about the witch? They say she's behind all these deaths. Didn't hear, didn't care. They say she can't die. Oh, lucky her. They say she doesn't age either. Oh, boy, I'm jealous. Yep, old age is gonna suck. Huh? Oh, uh, you know, arthritis and all that. There's a witch lurking somewhere in this town. Isn't it thrilling? Why would I think that? Ugh, you're so dull. Where's your sense of romance? <laughs> hey, does it ever scare you, not knowing who you are? Yeah, sometimes. But I feel so much better when I play my music. Well, that's good at least. You know, lately I've been forgetting some things myself. If you can't remember, maybe it's not that important. Maybe that goes for me, too. Then... I guess people care a lot if their lover's a boy or a girl. You said it doesn't matter to you, right? It's pretty open-minded. <sighs> The heart knows no bounds. Wow, you really make me think about things. Maybe the only thing stopping us is ourselves. I heard that dealer died in the mysterious deaths lately. And that's why you're scared too? I heard that dealer... And that... Girl playing the piano. I shouldn't. I'll just make the same mistake. This customer is a journalist. He seems to be obsessing over a certain legend lately. A legend? I was originally looking into these suspicious deaths that have been happening lately. I'm Justin, by the way. Hmm. Have I met you somewhere before? Come think of it. Um, I'm sure I've seen you before. Oh, sorry. We were talking about the legend. Anyway, in my research, I found records indicating that similar cases occurred in hundred-year cycles. Many men died last time as well. It's the truth. Wow. Every hundred years, huh? I found a strange variation on this legend going around, too. Hmm? There's a man who survives it. Survives the dreams? Very, very rarely. There's a man who is cursed but doesn't die. Isn't that interesting? It's said that the survivor is granted one wish. If he wished for eternal youth, he might still be around. <laughs> it's like a magic lamp. Well, if this is what you're coming up with, you have a wish in mind for yourself? Mm -hmm. To live forever? Not too typical? Me? I'd wish for something different. Like what? I may wish to change the past and make someone kill me. Oh, uh, <laughs> I wonder what I'd wish for. You got a mail. game over there some stages are supposed to be impossible but they're a cinch if you've got technique I think I'm pretty good at coming up with techniques you got a mail And he 
was extremely loose with his relationships with women. I heard his funeral got stopped because women were fighting each other. Oh. Well, you can't talk about it like you're unrelated to it. This lovely couple is Daniel and Anna. Huh? Vince? Vincent Brooks? What? Wait, do I know you? It's me, Daniel. We went to elementary school together. Oh, uh... What? You don't remember me? Oh, so you're Vincent. You're different from what I imagined. Don't say that. You see, Vincent, I, I'm different from back then. I'm not the one tagging along. Now I'm the leader. I'm the heir to a successful business. A business heir, huh? Because of that. Wait, I heard your voice somewhere. Was it yesterday? I think of it. Maybe I had some premonition of our meeting today. Anyway, I can't believe you don't remember me, man. I'm sorry. It's just, I didn't know what to say. Yeah, I know. I think I was being too harsh on you, too. And then I got twisted up over it and called you. <laughs> it's okay, really. All right. That's all. Goodbye. Excuse me. Hey, boss. Ever lose your memory drinking? Oh. Did you? Yeah. I have when I was young. Especially when I was in my 30s. I started to blank out on amounts I used to be able to handle in my 20s. And then I'd wake up lying next to a complete stranger. Ah, so it has happened. I'm in a complete stranger's house? That hasn't happened to me. I'm at the police station, stark naked, right? No. The nakedness of woman is the work of God. To misappropriate the musings of a certain someone. In front of God's work of art, it's only natural that your faculties are preoccupied. Well, just don't worry about it. Uh, guess I won't. You got a mail. Fledgling learn to fly is quite uplifting. I must say, having Rin work here has really helped motivate me to continue running this place. What has Erica been doing to you? Employing a pianist, huh? I guess this bar's ranked up. Women are always looking for better men to be with. A man's worth is based on how many women he has. Romance is such a pain. Okay, you can't be serious. Can you? <laughs> and let me introduce you. This is Todd, and this is Archie. Are you on your way home from the office? Or not? You're not wearing a suit. A suit? Oh, I don't have that kind of job. That's a shame. You're not one of our customers, then. What do you mean? We make business suits. Haven't you ever heard of Bantam suits? Have you heard the jingle? You'll be the cock of a walk in a Bantam. Oh, you're from Catherine's company. Hey. I think I've heard your voice before. Huh? I swear I've heard this song before. Have we met? Come to think of it, but I don't remember anything. Yeah, I don't think I'd forget seeing a mop of hair like yours either. It's not a mop. Don't talk about my hair like a cleaning supply. Still, you know what they say. The more hair a guy has, the easier it is to get the ladies. What? Really? All the chicks will be clucking over your fine comb. <laughs> Good one. Can we leave soon? I thought you said only one drink. You 
got a mail. Because all you do is play Rapunzel. You should try it. I'm sure that princess is a hottie. She's a bunch of pixels. Seriously. What? Are you one of those guys who can only get turned on by real life women? Uh, it depends. You got a mail. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
Seriously?
Seriously? No more continues, maybe? <laughs> for oil outside the apartment. It seems a group known as the police called. They said no one's come forward with any information about me. But I guess that means I wasn't important to anyone. Oh, don't say that. I'm sure there's a good reason. We'll be okay. We've got Erica and the rest of us here to help. Yeah. I guess you're right. Thank you. Vincent, are you okay? What do you mean? Oh, um, nothing. It's getting late. I was just wondering if you're going home soon. Just a hunch, but I think you're going to be pretty busy tomorrow. Really? Okay, then I'll keep that in mind. staying up all night practicing piano. I hope all that hard work pays off. Yeah, I'm sure it will. Wait, if that was happening next door, wouldn't you have heard it by now? Those walls are pretty thin. And the bar is closed at that time. Where the heck is Rin practicing? judge tonight at the Inquisition. Am I seeing things?
Oh, is that name Cursed? By the way, you think Rin will ever get her memory back? I don't know. There might need to be something to trigger it. Yeah, maybe playing that piano will help. Anyway, let me know if anything happens. I got your back. <sighs> Lately, going home to an empty house really hurts, you know? served in small glasses so they can be consumed while the cocktail is still cold. On the other hand, long drinks are cocktails made to be enjoyed for an extended period of time. They are served in a large glass. Whether you want to take your time and discuss the meaning of life over a drink, or gulp it down and get it over with, the choice is yours. That was the cocktail trivia for tonight. Empty already? Hey, can I get a drink? Which one would you like? I need a beer. Sake, please. I'll take a beer. Beer. Hold on just a second. Be careful not to drink too much. I'm surprised no one's come forward with any information about Ren. Maybe no one's realized she's missing yet. Hmm. Wonder what her story is. Uh, shh. It's this late already? If I don't go home, I'll make Catherine worry again. Yo, Vincent, we're leaving now. You're not going home yet? I'm sticking around a little more. Need some time to think. Vincent! I'm going home now. Thanks for stopping by. It's almost time. <laughs> Quit trying to delude yourself and come. Did I, did I just hear something? Aha! Uh -huh. You're here. I found you, Vincent. Ah. <sighs> if she's pregnant, then that really means marriage, huh? This month, I'm running really late. I think I'm pregnant. Me raising a family? That doesn't exactly sound like a recipe for success. <sighs> Another Catherine? That... Don't call me that. It's embarrassing. What do you want to do today? Uh, actually, I. The perfect toy for a healthy baby. So much fun. Uh. Hey, uh, hello? Hey, why are you just staring at the TV like that? Uh, oh, um... Hmm? When a baby won't stop crying, you have to gently... A baby? Oh, I get it, Vincent. All right, there, there. It's okay. What's going on? Um, what was that? <laughs> This is what you wanted, right? You were staring hard at that baby on TV. Oh, no, I was... <laughs> now you're my little baby. Don't you worry about a thing. Uh... Something wrong? You're being awfully quiet. Is your tummy grumbling? You want mommy's milk, don't you? Huh? <laughs> what? Uh... Uh... There's no need to worry. You'll get some real soon. What do you want to do today? I have something to do. What? You're so cold, jeez. Too close. 
<laughs> Drinking here together, doesn't it bring back memories? It means we're old now. In high school, I wanted to grow up quick and be free. But now that we're adults, I realize that it's not that easy. No kidding. You guys haven't changed at all, though. You're always hanging out together. I had to laugh when I heard you started working at the same place Orlando does. Well, so what? It's the only place hiring. I'm jealous. Of what? In the end, you're hanging out with us here, too. I ended up like this because I don't have anyone to love. Where are all the good men? How about boss here? No, uh, 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 no way. <laughs> he probably heard that. I made sure to say it so loud just so he'd hear it. I don't know. I still feel like going home today. something to do already well bye bye vincent Just stay the same. You're going to have to watch yourself from now on. You know what I mean, right? Oh, but I plan to go back to work after having the baby. We'll just have to split up the housework, okay? You can't throw your clothes everywhere anymore. to escape judgment, you'll have to run. This stage will challenge your cognitive abilities. Use the properties of falling blocks to wisely climb the wall that stands before you. What is this place? Ugh! 
try and undo it. starting to see these dreams. Is this some kind of karmic payback for being a police officer? I wish I could at least remember this stuff when I wake up. Wait, did you say you were a police officer? Hmm. Do I know you from somewhere? I think so. It's kind of weird trying to recognize a sheep, isn't it? 
Seeing how you don't seem very winded, I can't be exhausted. I'll go talk to the others. Seeing how you don't seem very winded, I can't be exhausted. I'll go talk to the others. Vincent! Oh, I'm so glad you were able to make it up again. You've come pretty far, huh? Thanks to you. What did I do? You told me that the only one who can decide how to live my life is me. Never thought of it that way before. I just assumed things were off limits before I even considered them. So now, I finally decided that I'm just gonna go for it. We got this. The other sheep and I, we'll make it through. <laughs> I really like that about you, Vincent. Um, can I be by your side cheering you on? Of course. That'd be a big help. I'm starting to regain my memory. This outfit I'm wearing, I think my brother gave it to me. I think it was on my birthday. I remember him smiling and, and saying it looked nice on me. I'm glad to hear that things are starting to come back to you. Your brother must be worried. We've got to get you back to normal so you can go home. Yeah. I should... Was that really Vincent? Me. Why would he appear just when I'm going through a tough time? He doesn't even remember me. What have I been doing all these years? Hey, hey. The hell? Men hate the women who love them and are attracted to women who don't. Oh, it's all my fault. I'm sorry. I'm apologizing, okay? I'm sorry. Understand it. Yeah? Yeah? Who do you think you are? Come out here and face me like a man! It's about him. Ah! Who are you? Who am I? Hey, you. Me? What? It is you. You taught me a lot before. It's me. <laughs> I didn't see you yesterday, so I thought you were done for. I won't die. Not until I see her again. Wait. Is your family down here? Yeah, right. Don't you get it? It's only men that get thrown down here. What? Why are you worrying about other people? Save your own ass and get out of here. Why are you worrying about other people? Save your own ass and get out of here. I told her I'm rooting for her. When I first ended up here, I got really depressed. But she helped me out. There's a drawing I haven't finished. I can't die yet. I thought it was weird when that girl showed up, but I think I'm getting used to it. She always disappears once everyone makes it to the next landing. I wish I could do that. Just warp on up there. One time, I tried grabbing onto her clothes before she disappeared so I could go with her. But it didn't work. I guess she's special. Hey, listen. I thought of a great way to climb. Allow me to explain the wall spider. Always be aware of your surroundings when faced with an unclimbable wall. You can easily hang from blocks to reach your destinations. It's a beginner level skill, but don't forget it when faced with a challenging situation. What about it? 
Isn't it awesome? And would this work too? Allow me to explain the corner spider. Try moving blocks to form an L shape. When you are hanging, you can move between blocks that do not share an edge. Hey, I didn't even think about that. I'll tell the others how to do that. Thanks. Hello. Hey. Hello. If you make it to the top, you'll earn your freedom. Have you heard that? It's strange. I've heard a similar story before. The man who survives will have his wish granted. That's just a fairy tale, though. <laughs> it's just a rumor. Leaving that stuff will only lead to more disappointment. Falling for stuff like that only makes you look stupid. Hey, I wonder if I'm in this because I was associating with a young crowd in our company. Do you have a wife? Yes, a wonderful woman who doesn't suspect anything about her cheating husband. Oh, I'm grateful. Cheating is the sign of a better man. All the women flock around the superior males. Sexual selection dictates that women prefer stronger mates to father their children. My father, he was a shitty good-for-nothing. He might have appeared good to everyone. Huh? Or, <laughs> I'm sorry. But he was a shithead. Huh? Yo, we were waiting for you. Huh? Me? You're an amazing climber. We're talking about techniques. Wanna join in? Sure. Then I'll start off with the technique I came up with. Allow me to explain the cutout. Grab one block after another and move it towards your destination to provide a path. It's important to recognize which blocks you can let fall. Not bad, huh? Oh, wait a sec. Then would this be a technique too? Allow me to explain the cut across. Using the same principles of the cutout, throw out all the blocks you pulled out. By moving several blocks onto an unstable area, you can make your own stable footing. Ooh, that's incredible. Not bad, buddy. You're very perceptive. Let's see who can come up with the most techniques. I gotta go. Good luck to you guys. Hello. I'll get her back. Hey. <coughs> what do you want? Nothing really. Just wanted to wish you luck. What a kind fellow you are, Mr. Cross. He, on the other hand, can be very strict. During our lessons, all it takes is one small mistake for him to explode. Huh, kind. Huh. But you're here. You must be a scumbag, too. What did you do? What did you do for someone to want you dead? Uh, huh? Sorry. Never mind. I was working in the kitchen all night again, so I'm in a bad mood. Uh, hey, Shiny. Sing it again. Take it from the top. Hmm. You listening? Master Kuros, what do you see? What's the thing that chases you? Huh? Uh-oh. Huh? Sometimes it's my girlfriend. Sometimes it's... something else. I see. I envy you. You're being chased too, right? <laughs> Don't mind me. It's not. Well, time for my singing test. That gentleman with the scarf knows the song quite well. If someone hates you, that means they're obsessed with you. How much longer are we going to play this game? Stop complaining and sit down. Oh, man. Hello again, my little lamb. Looks like you and that pianist are getting on quite well. But I wonder, are you two really working toward the same goal? What do you mean? Appearing as a human without even climbing. Like some sort of 
overseer. What the hell are you talking about? What you choose to believe is up to you. Now let's hear it. This is the fifth question for a new possibility. Do you care what other people think of you? You chose that one. I'm slowly starting to know you better. Now, this is the fourth floor. Once you're past this, you will be halfway through. Finally, night after night. I wish you'd go easy on me, damn it. This is the punishment you had coming to you. I do feel a little bad, though. The one who dropped you into this place speaks to you on a daily basis as if they don't know anything, while laughing behind your back. What are you trying to say? <laughs> we'll go soon. This is the final area for tonight. A steep face is in your path. Stay calm and take it step by step.
You're stuck. Maybe it's best to try and undo your wounds. Edge. 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 Just calm down. You can still Edge. fight. I can bear it. Edge.
Remember, you can always go undo. back and undo Undo. Else. Edge. Undo. Undo. to try and undo your words. Undo. 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 I'm 
to extract your secrets. Let's look into the past once more, shall we? So you made it this far. Fascinating. I want to know what kind of person you really are. Why don't we pull up some more old memories? You've been hiding from them, like the day your love first bloomed. Gotta say, this is delicious. I'm so glad that we met up at that reunion. It's the least I could do. You're always listening to my problems. Well, I'd better get going. Am I really that undesirable to you? What? Catherine? There's something you want to tell me? You are beautiful. Um. How innocent you two were. Hmm. I wonder what changed. Or do you already know the answer to that? <laughs> so, what did you want to talk about? <sighs> what are you doing here? Are you okay? Did you drink too much last night? You called me over, and you don't even remember. Huh? No way. I mean, yesterday, I... <sighs> What's wrong? You're acting weird. Weird? Me? God, why can't I remember the time I spend with you? It's like... The important parts are missing. Oh, I remember them, though. <laughs> uh, well, I wonder why I... <laughs> Silly. Uh, that piano was so annoying. Huh? You think? My head hurts just listening to it. Long hair. That's Catherine's. What should I do? Should I just tell her? No, I can't let her find out like this. Oh, that's mine. Probably off my chest. <laughs> you know, manly. Huh? Your chest? <laughs> really? Yeah, yeah. You, you know, uh, it's it's that 
But you know when sometimes a long white hair grows on your body, it, it's good luck? But this is like really long. Yeah, I was growing it out. It just fell out by itself. <laughs> good thing too. It's bad luck if you pull it out yourself, you know? Oh, really? It's not from another girl, is it, Vincent? No, why, why would you say that? You know, because if it is, I'm going to die right here. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> knock it off with all the dying stuff, okay? Then I'll kill you. <laughs> I die, or I kill you. Which would be better? Take. Come on, come on, whoa, whoa, whoa. Ah! Fine, I'll give you five seconds. If you don't answer me, I'll kill you. One, two, huh? three, four. Hey, come on, come on. Quit fooling around. <laughs> Bye. There's no other girl. Right, you're imagining things. Hmm. Is that the truth? Of course it is. Hmm. <laughs> okay, I trust you. Thanks. <sighs> Is she gonna pull a knife on me one day or something? Oh, no, there is no one day. I've got to do something about this relationship. I'm not going to ask you about the past. It doesn't matter. But from now on, if you ever cheat on me, I'll be angry. Uh, <laughs> okay. <laughs> ah, to get that, do you? Whoa, 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 wait, hold on. <sighs> no. Huh? Hey! <laughs> what the heck? Why is this locked? Unchain this door! Uh Sure, but uh, hold on a second. <laughs> Who's that? <laughs> it is my landlady. <laughs> she was trying to open the door. <laughs> hmm? The landlady? Yeah, I forgot to pay my rent last month. <laughs> you know how it is with money. <laughs> you gotta be kidding. I'm gonna use the bathroom. What the hell, Vincent? What is this? Will you keep it down? Huh? One of my bosses is here. Huh? Really? Not the best time for you to be. Maybe I should at least say hello. He gets real grumpy if you wake him up. He's sleeping in the back. Well, if you really think it would... <laughs> He's awake? Yeah, hurry up! Now hey! go, 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 go. Uh, Sorry. I'm really sorry. I just wanted to protect you from the smell. Huh? He really smells, you know, and he was drinking last night. Oh, really? Yeah, I'm glad I got you out in time. Hey, we're not that close, but he kind of forced his way in while he was drunk. Oh. Well, he is your boss, huh? Yeah, he is. You just seemed really stressed, so I came to see how you were doing. Well, thank you. Uh, come by after work and I'll complain some more. <laughs> oh, I got you something from the new shop that opened up. Oh, uh, yeah? Here. I'll see you later. Owen, I am pregnant. <laughs> I just wanted you to know. Seriously? Was that why you really came here? I need to make up my mind quick. You don't know how that makes me feel. Seriously. See ya. Uh -huh. 
Oh, uh, she moved in recently. She works at the bar with Erica. Plays the piano. Oh, isn't she cute? Oh, uh, well, yeah. bye. Uh. <sighs> we still need to meet my parents and tell them. Oh, and we have to pick a name, but that might be rushing things. I'll text you the details later. I gotta go. <sighs> Meeting the parents. Am I just gonna sit here and let this happen? You got a mail. Oh. God, look at her. Oh, man, you look at those. What am I doing? I can't look away. No, no, I've made up my mind. I can't let her tempt me. Shit, if she finds out, I Rude. I gotta do something quick. No time to think about the future. Still. Mm. Is this girl? You're late. Did you see the movie where the guy was, uh, you know... Shut up, asshole! And just give me some toilet paper, please. Well, quit mumbling. I can't concentrate in here. Still, this girl. Look, girl? Hey, what are you looking at in there? I want to see. Oh, shit. God, what am I thinking? This can't go on any longer. I have to tell her to stop. Dude, do not delete that picture. So, uh, you still doing the two-timing tango? Yeah, don't say it like that. It wasn't on purpose. Well, if she is pregnant, you gotta bite the bullet. <laughs> yeah, you're only saying that because it's not you. Hey, man, variety is the spice of life. You need to enjoy it more. Just like the wasabi-coated sushi they serve here. You know what I'm saying, bro? You suck at metaphors. What I'm saying is, you've got... Pause. Options ahead of you. Yeah. Maybe Catherine would be happier as a single mom than she would be with you. What are you drunk? No, she wouldn't want that. Well, what exactly do you want here? <sighs> my mind and my heart don't exactly agree on that. Uh huh. Well, then you've got to be even more careful. If you're caught, you can't call it an accident anymore. I know. I know. Accidents, huh? One more of them lately. The old guy next door to me kicked the bucket. I heard shocking, huh? Thought he always did like to party. Probably party too hard. He had this horrible look on his face. Really? It's like that stuff on the news. <sighs> anyway, have some magro. It's supposed to be good for your circulation. 
Huh? You're as pale as a ghost, man. Oh. You going to the bar tonight? Uh, maybe. You? Nah, I have to pass today. Got overtime. But I guess all you can do is drink and forget, huh? <laughs> Pretty much. Enough with the shitty piano! Uh, uh, you're making my ears bleed. Oh, why don't you come play with me instead? Sorry, I'm in the middle of a performance. Huh? You gonna talk back to me too? All you bitches need to shut out the do what I say. Excuse me, but are you in charge of how other people live their lives? <sighs> What's your problem? You fucking... Hey! Would you give it a rest? I don't know what you're going through, but don't take it out on her. Besides, trying to make other people change is pointless. I mean, I'm not one to talk. But I'm telling you, if you want your life to improve, then it's up to you to... Was he even listening? <sighs> anyway... You okay, Rin? Yeah, thank you. Don't waste your breath on guys like him. Man, you say some thought-provoking stuff. It's like you got a whole nother perspective. Philosophic, man. Really? I think you're pretty amazing yourself. You always lift people up when they're down. <laughs> Do I? I mean, I've given people a lot of things to complain about. But you know... Hearing that from you makes me kind of feel like... <sighs> what the... Did we meet somewhere else? Ugh, damn it. Just confusing myself. Huh? Vincent, I'll be waiting for you. Don't forget, okay? Uh, yeah. Sure, I'll be here again tomorrow. You got a mail. She's gonna manage my account, huh? Vincent, thanks for standing up for me earlier. You always seem to be the one who helps me when I'm in trouble. <laughs> well, I didn't really do anything. Besides, you're the reason I was able to do it in the first place. Huh? Honestly, before I met you, I would have just looked the other way. When you told me that others couldn't tell me how to live my life, I started to gain a little more courage. I'm glad I was able to help you, Vincent. I'm so happy that you were the first person I met. You're really starting to get a handle on things. Oh, you think so? This is breaking news in our ongoing coverage of the rash of mysterious weakening deaths. The following people were proclaimed dead today. Can't say the same about me, though. Vincent, I'll be waiting as always, so please promise you'll come see me. Oh, uh, yeah. I come here every day, so don't worry. Um, Erica said that forgetting helps people move on. Do you think there are memories we're better off not remembering? Hey, thanks for helping Rin earlier. That guy's just having trouble with his wife. Oh, so that's what's going on. He's not a bad person, really. If he acts up again, I'll take care of it. I've been getting the feeling like people keep staring at me. Maybe I'm showing a little too much cleavage. It's just you. 
Hey, don't shoot me down just like that with three words. Come on. I know you sneak a peek at me every so often. No, I don't. <laughs> three words again? Does Johnny seem a little gloomy to you? Wonder if something happened. I started to think about our high school days after what happened to Paul. Well, boy, Paul loved the girls back then, too. You and Orlando were always doing stupid things. Didn't you guys once eat Catherine's lunch and get chewed out for it? Did we? I know she was mad, but she started bringing you snacks once in a while. Remember? I thought she just wasn't hungry. Eh, dumbass. There was so much going on back then. We were all busy with our own problems. It wasn't all fun, but I felt more alive. More than I do now. What's with you all of a sudden? Is something bothering you? No. <sighs> hey, really, what's, what's going on? I'm just reminiscing. I'm gonna have another drink. If you're going home, be careful. Sure. You got a mail. Hmm? No. tired. I haven't been able to sleep lately. I tried staying in my girlfriend's place, but that makes me even more tired. Your girlfriend, huh? What's she like? <laughs> what? You, you want to know? You never talk about her. Toby was wondering, too. There's nothing to talk about. Maybe later. Hmm? I'm gonna have another drink. If you're going home, careful. Yeah. Oh, that's kind of... Hello? Hey, what's up? Well, um... Oh, yeah. Have you eaten the cake I brought you? Oh, sorry. Not yet. Uh, I see. <laughs> Catherine? Vincent, have you been busy recently, or do you have something bothering you? W why do you ask? I mean... You seem to have been thinking about something for the past few days. Well, I can tell. Oh, well. I'm sorry. I'll call you later. Bye. This is our latest in the coverage of the mysterious weakening death epidemic. Matthew Miller was found dead today. We retraced his footsteps from the day before as part of our investigation. This epidemic. A horrible mess. According to his mother, who spoke with him on the phone, after that point, he'd been plagued with nightmares. 